How are you doing guys? Here's another install me. Um, I'm installing some Kellerman doors on my house right now. Alright, um, I should have did the unboxing, but I didn't. Alright, um, I'll turn around and let you guys see, get a look on how it's come. But these are custom doors. Um, these are going to be barn doors as opposed to the one that goes up and down. Alright, these are custom made uh, from a company in Pennsylvania. I forget the airplane going over. Um, it's something that my wife looked into. Um, they're very well made, and we got a delivery yesterday. All right. Um, this is my second uh, set of doors. The first one they sent me was too long. The company is very excellent. Uh, we came to a reasonable um, uh, conclusion of, uh, of, of the problem. And um, again, they sent me another set of doors that should fit properly um so uh, what i'm gonna do i'm gonna turn it around i'm gonna show you how it looks i already unpacked it but it comes very well packed it's, it's it was shipped here by freight um and that's it you know that's uh when you're dealing with custom doors you always got to check it first time around which i didn't and i didn't catch it and uh, the person who the architect from the company and i didn't check the um catch that discrepancy in that measurement so we both was at blame but they're very cordial they're very polite uh that we worked it out and um i'm very happy so i got the second second doors i'm trying to install them now and i'll take you through it i'm gonna do a little time lapse and um yeah that's it dude so let's check it out I'll, let, I'll turn around let you guys take a look at the doors itself all right guys here it goes um, when they come in they, they're very well packed all right it comes on a a pallet um, they're all wrapped up to the T um, they, they come with the styrofoam foam that's over it uh, it comes very well protected from, from the manufacturer all right they really do a real good job at packing this thing up all right this is the big old box that was covering it uh, I should have showed you initially but trust me it is when you do take delivery it's very important to check this the, the freight people because uh, the first one they sent me was damaged. Oh, well, I shouldn't say uh, they, uh, the, uh, the shipping company damaged it. All right. And when they use the hydraulic this way, if they go too high, they can damage it. All right. Now, I'll give you guys a little look of the damage of the first one, which the company, Kelman, they, they worked with me. Uh, they sent me out two replacement jams. So, I don't know if I can see, you guys can see this, but the first one was damaged right here. It was crushed by the freight company. I didn't catch it when it was first shipped to me. So, I, I explained that to the, to the garage door place. They said, no problem. We'll fix it. We'll, we'll send you another one. Um, a company with the, the new door. And, and they did. All right. Um, again, very happy with them right now. All right, and it's, so right now again, I'm, I'm installing it in front of my garage here, um, taking away this traditional up and down type of contraption and replacing it. So um, that's it. So I'm gonna step a little time lapse. Um, my measurements here is, is like 83 up, 95 across. So right now I'm about to do a cut on my saw. That's set up right here. Um, I triple double check, triple checked on my saw. Uh, right now, as you can see, and it's your other. I'm using the Harbor Freight uh, saw saw uh, miter saw stand. That's helping me a lot. So again, right now I'm about to make my cuts at the same time, so they both be perfect, so I can get it installed. So. Uh, enjoy the time lapse. Um, I'm glad I got these doors now. So, and that's it. All right. Uh, one as I go along. Um, uh, if any problems, I'll stop the video, come to it, and pretty much I'll show you what I'm doing. All right. So enjoy, guys. Oh, right, guys. I want to show you something. When you guys order order your uh, your door, all right, they're gonna send you a set set of plans and. Those plans is gonna be of what you sent them in for your rough up opening for your garage. All right, 
my rough opening for my garage I sent them was uh, 83 by 95 so 83 height 95 long all right you want to make it a little smaller to fit into your rough opening so you can shim it in and get it into play all right so I just made my cut and when he sent it to you which I like about it the guys at Kendall Indoors you can see they marked everything where they're supposed to go top jam A over there is B all right they also will tell me right here right listen this is the right side put B with B all right and let's go around here left side jam A with A I don't know if you guys can see that A here and A there so it's in you all the hardware for you to get this off um, again and they also marked the where you put your hinges is it's nice and machined in so it'll fit very nicely all right right here too one two three four so that's what I like about it right now so I just cut it my length with A3 they send it to you long so you got to cut it down on site which I did um, very important guys to make sure when you do install these things here from here to here it has to be leveled all right it has to be level because you want that to level up along with your hinges from here to here so your door is not cockeyed <laughs> alright so I took my time when I had the masonry guys do their work I made sure they made it level and um, so that's it so right now I'm gonna put the screws in they send you the screws a part of your package uh, sorry I didn't have this all laid out guys but they said your boxer, it, with everything in there, with the hinges, the hinges, uh, construction adhesive, the, the screws to go into the concrete to hold the threshold, and and that's it. Um, I got the screws. I what the heck I did with them? I probably took them downstairs because I I end up uh, calling to find out what certain things and another thing they sent you also they'll send you a scrap piece of wood and this wood will be used to cut your threshold your threshold is this here right here so you, they already sent it this is the length they can tell you all right use this to set your jam bottom which I'm gonna use so I'm gonna use this template to mark for my threshold right here to make sure I got the proper cut so that's one thing I like about it uh, they may they make it almost idiot proof um, so let me continue on I gotta find my screws so I can get the screws screwed into this so I can get it up and uh, shimmed into place so um, I'm gonna set up the camera outside for the time-lapse so again these are coming home doors custom-made from a company in Pennsylvania. I put a link to where they are uh, located. Uh, Shalom is the guy who helped us out. Very nice guy. And um, let's let's keep on with uh, the installation.